So this question looks like it's going to be a translate word problem question. Any question that is four or more lines long, I'm going to treat like a translate word problem. That's the strategy that I'm going to use, which means I'm going to really just focus my attention on one sentence at a time, making sure to write down any quantitative information as I see it versus reading the entire question all the way through and then having to try to recall and remember the details of what I read. So the first sentence here says Scott selected 20 employees at random from all 400 employees at a company. All right, so 20 out of 400 is what I'm going to say. That would be, you know, the fraction here. He found that 16 of the employees in this sample are enrolled in exactly three professional development courses this year. So, okay, out of the 20, right? So, in fact, I can say this: 16 out of 20 is uh, three professional three pro dev courses, okay? Uh, based on Scott's findings, which of the following is the best estimate of the number of employees at the company who are enrolled in exactly three professional development courses this year? Okay, so basically this fraction, not so important right now. This one, much more important. How do I know that? Well, because this fraction is all about just choosing 20 people out of 400 at random, right? This is the fraction that has to do with the actual three courses being taken. So 16 out of 20, I could find a percentage, um, but instead what I'm gonna do is set a proportion. I'm gonna say that the proportion of 16 out of 20, if it holds true to the entire um, group of 400 employees, then that 16 over 20 should be equivalent to X over 400. This is, again, not the only way to do it. Um, so here, when I multiply 20 by X, I get 20X. When I multiply 16 by 400, let me go to my calculator. 16 times 400. That's equal to 6,400. When I divide by 20 on both sides, I get zero. So cross out 640 divided by 2 is 320. So I have X is equal to 320. So I'd expect 320 of the 400 employees to also be enrolled in exactly three professional development courses this year because that would, so 320 over 400 is an equivalent proportion or ratio to uh, 16 out of 20, right? And that's basically what the question's asking us to determine. Another way to solve it would be to find a percentage, right? We can say, well, 16 out of 20 is equal to what? That is equal to 0 0.8, which is the same as 80%. So I can then say, well, if 80% of the 20 people selected were in these three courses, then my expectation is that also 80% of the entire group, right? So I just do a 0 0.8 times 400, and that would also get me 320. So that's another way to approach this question as well.